Welcome to SQL Developer Demonstration. In this demo, you'll learn how to use the Migration Wizard to migrate from a third-party database to Oracle. Once you've established a connection to your source database and you've created a migration repository, you're ready to use the Migration Wizard. For this example, I will be migrating from a Sybase database. Select your source database connection Right-click to open up the context menu. Select Migrate to Oracle. This will open up the Migration Wizard. You notice that there's a series of steps that you'll be going through. The first step is identifying the Migration Repository. You'll then give your project a name, specify your source database, Capturing the source database, you'll then convert your metadata and then translate any SQL. Select your target database, then you're ready to move your data. At any point in each of these steps, you'll have the option of proceeding directly to the summary page. This allows you to exit the migration wizard and you can come back to the wizard at a later time. For this step, this is where you select the connection that holds the migration repository. Give your project a name. I'm migrating from Sybase, and the database is PubsQ. For the output directory, this is where I want to specify location where I want the generated scripts and all the migration logs to be stored. Click on Choose to navigate to the location. In the Source Database step, this is where you can choose to either do an online or offline migration. If you have a large migration, you want to go ahead and select offline. This will generate the migration scripts for you to be able to execute at another time. Since we have a small database we're going to be migrating, I'll leave the default of online mode. In the connection, this is where I specify the source database. And in the capture step, I'll select the database that I'll be migrating. It's PUBS2. And now you're ready for the next step. 